Services for Donnie Ray Crawford were held today at Rama in Broken Arrow. Crawford died last Saturday after his maternal grandfather shot him. Authorities say it was a selfless, unprovoked shooting. Two News reporter Brandon Richard joins us live in Broken Arrow tonight. Brandon. That's right, Jason, and it's been an emotional roller coaster for the Crawford family, but they can take some solace in that Donnie Ray impacted and touched so many lives, whether on the racetrack or at school. That can be proven by the number of people who showed up for the funeral this afternoon, literally hundreds of people from across the country from the racing circuit, those who knew Donnie Ray, those who didn't know him but knew of him in some way. They all said the same thing. Donnie Ray was a legend in the making, was someone with a great sense of humor, and was full of life. Just willing to do anything for anybody. Pretty much just the kind of person that you want to be and be around all the time. Now, the funeral also included a video celebration of Donnie Ray's life, hundreds of photos of him as a baby to a teenager to a young man, and you can tell by the photos just how tight-knit this family is. And because Donnie Ray not only loved racing, but also made education a priority, his family has set up a racing scholarship fund for future race car drivers. Those who want to contribute to that fund can do so at the American Bank in Collinsville. Reporting live in Broken Arrow, Brandon Richard, 2 News, works for you. Thank you.